Welcome to Liquid Rubber's Instructional Video Library. Today we're going to demonstrate how to waterproof the field of a flat or low sloped roof. Here is a list of things you'll need. When waterproofing a flat or low sloped roof, make sure that all the seams, corners, drains, and protrusions are covered with liquid rubber seam tape. Determine the area and the amount of geotextile required before you start applying liquid rubber waterproof sealant. Coat the seam tape, corners, and roof edges with liquid rubber waterproof sealant. Use a brush or a roller to coat the area in sections with liquid rubber waterproof sealant. Start from the corner or roof's edge and move inward, working in two feet sections to start. Keep in mind that applying excess material will increase curing time. Now embed the geotextile into the wet liquid rubber sealant. Lay the roll of geotextile at the corner or roof's edge and roll it towards you. When the geotextile is in place, use a roller to firmly embed into the coating. You should see some of the liquid rubber waterproof sealant soak through the geotextile. Apply generous amounts of liquid rubber waterproof sealant on top of the geotextile, pushing it into the surface to saturate the fabric. Repeat these steps as you move down the row. Apply the liquid rubber waterproof sealant to the surface. Roll and embed the geotextile into the wet coating. Then coat the top side of the geotextile and repeat. Be sure to cover the entire row before moving on. When starting a new row, overlap the geotextile by 3 inches. The geotextile is marked by 3-inch thin red lines to help ensure proper application. Repeat the application across the next row. Coat the roof surface with liquid rubber waterproof sealant. Roll and embed the geotextile into the wet coating and coat the top side of the geotextile. When addressing the drain, apply a fresh coat of liquid rubber waterproof sealant around and inside the drain. Roll the geotextile directly over the drain. Use a roller to embed and saturate the fabric. Identify the drain cavity. Use an X-Acto knife and cut an X across the drain cavity, creating four flaps that expose the inside wall of the drain. Push the four flaps down inside the drain, making sure they stick to the inside wall. Use a roller to coat the geotextile with liquid rubber waterproof sealant. Use a paintbrush to apply liquid rubber waterproof sealant around drain and inside walls. Repeat the process until the entire roof area is covered. Allow proper time for the coating to dry. The coating will turn from brown to black when fully dry. To create a stronger reinforced waterproof membrane, apply a second ply perpendicular to the first layer. We recommend a 2 mm minimum thickness for horizontal waterproofing. Thanks for watching and please visit liquidrubber.ca for more information.